after eight years of creating programs with Servir Antico, inspired on s some of the most amazing thinkers, visionaries, artists and musicians from the past, we have decided to record our first program or our first recording with the program The City of Ladies. This project is inspired by the vision of two humans of the past. The first one is a revolutionary woman from the Renaissance, Christine de Pizan, who is known as the first female professional writer from Europe. She wrote about diverse subjects, from love poems to treatises on politics, and in her visionary work, The City of Ladies, she starts building an imaginary city where every brick is made out of the history of a woman. This will be a fundament on which to build a society where women are respected and treated as equals as to men. The other figure is the male poet Martin Lefranc, who follows Christine in defending the role of womankind in history and helps her to write a more inclusive story of humankind. The program of the City of Ladies is a musical praise to womankind through the works of contemporaries of Christine de Pizan and Martin Lefranc, as well as some new compositions inspired in their writings. We include music from the art subtilior, or the subtle art, with sensual and complex compositions of Baudcordier and Solage, who render tribute to the earthly woman. We also include some anonymous compositions where women and men are complementary in their nature and enjoy of each other as equals. Some of the most intimate songs of Gilles Banchois and Pierre Fontaine are going to take us into the intimate and interior world of Christine de Pizan. And in the works of early Renaissance composers like Dufay and Giselin, we're going to give a message of hope through the beauty and kindness of their lines. I am extremely happy and honored to be working with an amazing team of outstanding musicians and dear friends who have not only immerse themselves in this music, but also in the subject that concerns us all. The Belgian soprano Liselotte de Wilde and the alto Dina König from Germany and Kazakhstan are joined by the French tenor and multi-instrumentalist Michael Grebil, who is going to be the voice of Martin Lefranc, and Colline Dutilleux, also from Belgium, is going to be the voice of Christine de Pizan. Norwen Le Guern on the medieval fiddle or vielle and me or the, and on the organetto or portative organ and musical direction are going to complete this team. And here it's probably the most important message. My commitment as founder and director of Servir Antico is not only to explore and share some of the most beautiful music from the past, but also to be inspired by it for new creation and to inspire with it. In the City of Ladies, we want to acknowledge all those women and men who have paved a path for a society with gender inclusion and equality, thinking outside of the frames of their own society and time. But besides a positive message, we also want to make out of this a call for action, starting with ourselves. So after we're able to produce this recording, we're going to be spending a 40% of all the earnings of direct sales in concerts or online for investing on a micro loan or microfinancing platform that is going to be supporting women from around the world in their mission, vision and work in creating positive changes in their own communities. Every contribution is going to help us make this possible. So thank you already for spreading the word 
for checking out our crowdfunding site and I hope you get to enjoy this music and all the stories about women that we're about to tell. Thank you. <laughs>